But uh, again, it's the last time they did play this map was in late March. So it's been a little bit now, but 9Z definitely have what it takes to, to go toe-to-toe -to -toe as we saw last night. This buy shouldn't be the end-all be-all for, for 9Z thus far though. Complete save in that sense, just a P250 on Buddha and a Deagle on DGT. Shot. DGT actually manages to find a second as well. That's decent damage, but he's about to walk into his death. Fakes out NQZ nicely, but you know, and I think he might have seen try. So that's now a lot of information. And Max is gonna try and pounce off the back of it, and even though Cold's blind, you want to get that opening frag. He's stuck behind the site though. There's so many players to deal with, it's gonna be a, a bit of a brawl toward this side of the map. Next gets one, next gets two, almost a third. Try now one versus two, but NQZ all on his own here. First player is low, but there's more coming his way, and they actually line up, but it was kind of one player up, one player down. Three versus two, rotation is quick from next, and in comes the Molotov toward Van to push them away from that position. And Cold is now lurking up connector, but DGT is still staring at it. What is, he go is he actually going to go deep to check it? He is. Now, Cold has a lot of pressure, though. He drops the bomb and oh. he even gets a second, too. That's sick from Cold. And it puts Buddha in a really tough situation. And he even oh. a hold. In comes the bounding Glock to try and get the AKs into the action. And QZ will get the first. There's a lot more coming his way. And they play the headshot angle nicely. DGT gets that frag, but Jamal now is going to bail this round out. Max needs to push him down, but there's another player in action. Of course, it's block that off. Try has one, but it's not being used as of yet. He'll now deploy it. Now, utility is gone for 9 z a big lurk from Jamal, Ooh. caught by Lato. That's a huge one to take. And now, with the water players known, Buddha has to try and look for this frag. Dancing around in the water. Still a three versus three. Big headshot from Jamal. Bomb will go down from Try. And QZ could have gone for that wall bang if he really wanted to, but Try will advance his position anyway. So it's all down to DGT. Headshot angle toward the back of Jail. As the first duel hits the head. I'm in thick and fast because Zero Zero Nation are hot on their heels. Looking to defend from the back of Dice, but now he's going to get spawned upon, so he's under a lot of pressure. And he manages to go one for one, and then DGT gets into the action to help out. Bomb is dropped in the open, but DGT from Cold Zero. Only a Tech 9, it's really hard to deal with him, and they're trying to triangulate his position, trying to claim this rifle for their own, but they're going to have to spend, expend a lot of time and a lot of resources to do so. Yeah, and tries in position once again. <laughs> trying to pre-fire it but okay there's a dual one and that's a gun that could be recovered for Dumal but DGT is here to help out try just in case and he's the only with the Glock trying maybe to play smoke fed on the right hand side DGT isn't aware of that he's with the Glock and even though he hits a dink it's only for half health now Dumal will just shift and he's oh. actually going to circumvent Lotto entirely and bomb. that's the bomb the bomb has been dropped and another kill's been given over, and he finds Lotto lurking in mid. So all the information has been given over to 9Z, and surely this is where the end is nigh for 0 0 -8. You'd think so. Cole has to use his smoke to hop across the angle, but DGT still is comfortable on this angle, and now he has support from David as well. Double spray down for him. And now Lato, his flank was very much known. Nine seconds, he's about to be spawned by everyone. And Max will get that final kill to sort it out. Great stuff from Nines being used. Flash is coming out to now. All first one's called apartments, but David is still here with the duallys. He spams away with two. Those duallys all oh, him to get a multi-kill from that sort of position, don't they? Try then swings wide toward ramp, looking for Lato, and Ooh. taps him beautifully. And Damal is left a day late and a dollar short. Really tried to sell something with that B attack, but I think a couple of footsteps had been heard by David underneath the balcony. And that must have been relayed over. He does very well to get two. Try does very well himself to get a multi-frag as well. And Dumao is left with just a flashbang, no armor. Time desperately going for him with the only rifle. Pistol's going to be rushing their way out ramp, but DGT is standing tall right now. And try or swing. I mean, though, he's playing with his food with the MP9. He even played with the ladder to grab that one and chew up Lato. It will go down, but NQZ will get the bomb planted, which is a good oh. success. And the Tech is doing some good tapping right now. He's playing with the angle, and DG does push him away. There is help, though, from short, and that does so much damage. 
Butterfly will get tagged down, but Buddha sorts out two. EGT gets another, and then Lato is left. Kind of disconnected from the action. Looking for at least a one dig, and he will get a two dig. <laughs> Only one kill, but on the second bullet. Bomb, though, is impossible to pick up with the positioning of DGT. David is also using as well. EGT will keep his teammate away from the danger, but Lato is just taking a straight up duel toward Palace, and that's why. Because it's a fake, and they're going toward A. 4v4, 9z are locked out. Really cool call there from Cold Zero. I mean, they're trying to look at what, what options that they had and they try to circumnavigate the B side. And as soon as Buddha gets that kill, they get that info from Cat, they immediately pounce onto the A side. But this round is not over. A lot of kills going into the favor of 9z regardless. And Cold Zero and NQZ have got to do it all. Two kills for them, Molly onto the bomb. And time continues to expire. DGT's got to make a move. UGT will get at least one tap, but NQZ now has to dance around, dance around, AWP versus AWP, and NQZ oh. David will swap the first player going into a jungle, and he's not necessarily aware of where he was yet, because he was open to that flag coming in, but it's only the pistols, and Demao is cleaning them up. Like Three kills. To go through a grey screen, Max is going to push Perfect. through this smoke, and he's cut Cold Zero face to face, oh. and he manages to drop the bomb as well. Grabs that AWP Max in a terrific <laughs> spot, but Dumao just rips his head clean off. Yeah. Bomb plan in for Cold Zero at the tail end of this round, and Zero Zero Nation dodge a bullet and a half there. That was uh, probably the best Max could have done in that scenario. Basically the perfect. Sometimes you're not willing to use their smokes initially to pick that out. They're just going to wait and they're going to re-aggress. As soon as they do, they get one opening trade. And there goes Try to get a second. Oh. Try with three. And it's just magical stuff from the AWP to at least get them a bomb plan and potentially the round here. But NQZ and Doom are quick to arrive. That's on the ace here. They're trying to clean up everyone, but in the end it's not. Cover a few of their games. It's certainly a lot of fun. Axile. Farming up Sync Esports, but they most certainly didn't do a, uh, a bad job as the huge underdogs in that qualifier. Nice strike from the USPs in this round, at least something for Zero Zero Nation to write home about, but it's only going head to head. Really fun to see. Fire's owning at the moment, but Nato, that's a really big hole. Thankfully for 9Z's case, they do have Max as the second man over to get that quick frag, but Next up with Buddha in the meantime, and DGT's oh! pulled out his knife, and why not, to be honest? Never in a million years would you expect next to push that smoke. And just on the edge of the balcony there. Flash comes in, that flash oh. is, could not be better. Could not be better, and it sets up Buddha for the entry. Dumao is now very, very stuck. He's picked up the orc, but he's in an awful position for it. He's a huge multi-frag round, and it's not going to happen for him. David removes him, and David is eager to finish this job, but actually he walks into his teammate's Molotov. Maybe a bit too eager to get this one done, and Try takes him down inadvertently. Try will actually swing for another, and Lato takes him out, so now it's a bit worrying. Back into a 2v2, and they're a little bit too aggressive, and Buddha looks like he could go for the round of world play. Max is still in position as well. They have a smoke for the bomb. And it's only Thank a tap you. to begin for now, as you say. No defuse kit in play. Max will reveal his position. He doesn't actually know if they're on it yet. And Lato picks at the right time. But in comes Buddha. There's the long con play, and it's going to work out great. He needs to find Lato in the smoke, though. It's being held by Lato. Still being held, but the smoke has faded. And 9Z, the South American powerhouse, is going to Texas to play in IEM Dallas. Congrats to 9Z for converting a very difficult final to predict right i mean from the get-go we already said that they did